Hi, I'm Ken Moore. I'm going to show you how to make a Wiimote light pen for use with the Wiimote whiteboard and other Wiimote hacking projects. I think you'll like this design. The pen is sturdy, self-contained, and it's cheap and easy to make. I've posted the instructions as well as a shopping list on my blog, KenMoreDesign.com. So let's see what we need to buy. At Office Max, you can find a pack of four Expo dry erase markers for just $7. Make sure to get these specific ones so the battery can fit inside. Now take a trip to Radio Shack for the following. Two infrared LEDs, two LED holders, two momentary push-button switches, two one and a half volt N-size batteries, two N-size battery holders, and a soldering kit if you don't already have one. Your pre-tax total for all of this is $30.50. Not bad. First, over a trash can, remove the marker tip and core with a pair of pliers. Be careful, the ink can spray a bit. You'll want to wipe out the inside of the marker to remove any remaining ink. Now drill a quarter inch hole for the push button switch at the spot where your thumb naturally rests on the grip. The push button is a hair larger than a quarter inch diameter, so you'll need to grind the edges a bit to widen the hole until the push button fits snugly. With a fine piece of sandpaper, scuff up the surface of the LED. This helps diffuse the light to improve tracking. Remove and discard the nut and washer from the LED holder. Put the LED stems through the LED holder and slide the rubber plug onto the stems until it's tight. We put the LED on the outside of the LED holder, again so more light shines out to improve tracking. Solder an 8 inch length of red wire to the positive lead, which is the longer one. You can also tell by looking inside the bulb, the positive electrode is the smaller one of the two. Now solder an 8 inch length of black wire to the negative lead. Thread the wires through the body of the pen and use pliers to screw the LED holder into the tip of the pen. This takes some force, but the end result is nice and snug. Now fish the black wire through the hole of the push button. Snip the wire about an inch from the hole and then solder that to one terminal of your push button. Slip the remaining black wire into the pen body and solder it to the other push button terminal. Gently press your push button into place and all that's left is to hook up the battery. Trim off some of the excess wire so there's more room for the battery to fit in. Once it's soldered up, slide the battery and wire into the back of the pen and push the end cap back on as far as it'll go comfortably. That's it. Now you have your own homemade LED light pen. Have fun and let me know how it goes.